My name is Insane Raven. I'm back with another episode of Spider Man Story Time. Um, I think I think we have another stealth mission coming up with MJ. Electro trying to destroy our power grid. The vulture raining death from above. Spider Man egging them both on in the very heart of our city, crawling like children. Lethal children. Pitching a tantrum of death and destruction. I'm often asked, why do menaces like this end up with awesome powers? Why not someone like you, Jonah? <laughs> well, I have considered trying to use advanced science to give me powers, only so I could protect you in a more hands-on way, of course. But after much reflection, I've decided against you. Because power... I mean, to be fair, the last time you tried it... We mean Scorpion. One of the hard-working, ordinary people of New York. So I'll just help via my talk show, my publishing empire, and my vast personal fortune. No need to thank me. It's what a man of the people does. I'm sorry, did he end that sentence with a, a vast for- With the sentence, my vast fortune, and then comboed it with, but that's just what a man of the people does? People control, requesting status update from Museum Miles. Because I'm not quite sure you know what those words mean, my dude. Overdrive. Not what I want. I want to switch over to this. New suit? Ooh. I like that. I like that. But I gotta go over here to Electro Spider Bro. Ow. Oh, okay. Everyone dead. Yep, everyone dead. And yes, I did just do it for the trophy. It's fine. You love me. Moving on. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. All right, let's go, MJ. Can you not do that on my bed, dog? I mean, I know you gotta clean yourself, but not like four inches away from where I put my face. All I'm asking. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. I need to get into the security room to unlock it. Okay. There's the security room, but that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Never happened. Alright, let's go. Mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It all went big. Oh, every second we stay down here. Let's start a riot. A riot. Let's start a riot. Da -da 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 -da. They have to let us back upstairs. That should do it. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. 
Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I got a stun gun. I know a few Sable agents who would... Bang, bang. I like this thing. It is handy. Got movement, stand by. Good boy. Oh, I dig it. Lover's workman's comp elevator controls in the security room next to the sable agent. Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to get off that elevator. Super spy. Oh, Silver Sable and uh. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. And Osborne together? Ugh. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Find one. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Best in the world right there. Can't even hear a reporter muttering loudly to herself. Best in the world right there. Sabre needs to return that plaque or whatever the fuck they got. Because best in the world, they are not. Oh, what are we doing here? Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. As long as he doesn't come with a flying disc, we're fine. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. MJ, you gotta tell your partner these things, man. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? You don't. That's where you build a top secret room. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. The fabulous Osborne boys. The family portraits. It's not gonna be over here. Wait, is that the family portrait? Did they look at this gun? Looks like a boatload of electrical is routed right behind that painting of Norman. Okay. So maybe that's all you got from there. Combat <laughs> prototype schematic for the prototype mask. Norman seems to be pushing Oscorp towards defense work. mask is incredible it is is it showing a door hidden in that wall i wonder where it leads oh, 
Done in my own sec, Norman. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Okay. I didn't think so. I thought, it, thought it'd be too easy, but I had to try. We got a number on that? Nope. I feel like this is the type of game that I would say when I got it, you know? Scientific journals debating the Spider Man problem. So weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. Step into my pod. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Um, okay. Don't... <sighs> Norman could be back any minute. I need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or... Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? This room smells like rich people. <laughs> as far as wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. What? I forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto Pax in Bello, Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Of course they have. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, okay. Anyway. So the drone's probably gonna have the info I need, right? I know I don't. Probably. It's enough, but thank you, Dad. You know for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. <laughs> Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Can I just break in? I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. God, I'm just breaking. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. What's today? I put Harry... I've sent him away. For treat. What? Fix him, Em. What? I promise. What? Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail Harry. 
I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Ham. I know you'll keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. Apparently not. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Uh, probably when Octo started losing his hair. Probably. I'd have to guess. Hair loss is Emily. friendship killer. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. It feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. Uh, it's been lovely playing house, but it's time. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney, like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. Don't get me wrong, I'm curious, but I want to speed things along. We should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. I mean, he's not wrong. She's done a bloody awful job. I'm getting here. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Watch your sixes, men. I can't go in. Oh. Time to run. Oh, okay. I didn't see it on my left. On my right? Took the guy on the left. Didn't take the guy on the right. Okay. Take him. Hello? Who's that Wait. Oh, I threw it away. Okay. Maybe if I hang right. Not the way I wanted to be facing. Huh. We're all clear, control. Alright, he's looking that way. Take him out. Nothing here. Resuming 
Shit. Go this way. Not this way. This is also the wrong way. Okay, where the fuck do I go? Oh, shit. Okay. July 18. Bingo. Suit, gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. Yep. Norman Osborne, GR twenty. Was it an Oscorp spider that did this to Peter? All right, we got we got our place. Capable of a cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next eighteen months on PR mop up. What a waste of time! Devil's breath isn't a disease; it's an attempt at a cure. I almost can't believe it. Have you not been listening to Peter this entire time? I'm pretty sure Peter told you that. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create? The ultimate spider. Wait. That's a piece of paper. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR27 was developed to treat them. Oh, he's trying to cure Harry. For Norman's own family. Okay. What is this? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's property. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Sable troop deployment. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Devil's Breath Lab must have a... Should check the good old out. Devil's Breath Lab should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Good old Alpha T. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big sable presence. GR27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. Yay! Temple Cathedral. Isn't that. 100% just guessed my way to victory. I knew it. Tenthen Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. What? That's this kid. Oh shit. Oh no, wait, that's Lee? Lee was a trial? Oh, he killed his parents. Because Lee was on the trial. Oh shit. They created Lee. I 
I have to get this. Shit. Best in the world, security. Spider Woman, Spider Woman. Spider Woman, Spider Woman. Pete, I've got the lab location and a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. We got the best in the world security, but I don't mean anything because my name is Mary Jane. Wait. My name is. Also, why why did it actually do that that way? That was the dumbest way I could have done that. Actually, why would you? Okay. Hey, with that way. Huh? Who's there? So my name is Mary Jane. Clear that balcony. Do I? Go to alert. Compromise, Do I need to clear the balcony? I feel. I feel like if I just tell Peter, yo, I'm jumping off of a thing right now. You hear? Turn it off, Lex. Now. Are you okay? We'll be in a few seconds. Northwest corner. Dude, it's a glass window. Shoot the window. Oh, the women have to do all the work. Hey, you ready? Wait, wait, hold on. It's too late. You're up. I trust you, Spider Babe. You are crazy. You're amazing. Trusty Spider Babe. Also, I wish I was wearing the Sam Raimi suit for that moment. Oh! That's killer, but. It's a good shot. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick? Norman and Lee? And Dr. Octavius? I know. It's so much. And so little. This is all my fault. How is it? Literally, how is it your fault? We literally just went over how it's not your fault. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. Tell her you love her. Look at her, you know you do. Just say the fucking words, it won't fucking kill you. Spider Woman, Spider Woman, we're gonna get a Spider Woman. I have to get that anti serum and start putting things right. Okay. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. 
They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. <laughs> You'd be surprised. But that's going to be it for this episode. I will see you guys in my next video. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.